purpose of this video is to really find out who else out there is suffering from severe scoliosis with a spinal fusion from the 80s when you were a teenager in high school if you had severe scoliosis like I did then you had it corrected probably because the braces didn't hold it and that that's what happened to me anyway in 2008 I had revision surgery a fusion extension my fusion was taken apart and all new hardware however the pain was not getting much better so I had another surgery about a week later my fusion was extended to the sacrum and that did the trick at the time I could tell right away I recovered from that surgery and then I still had limitations of course but it was tremendously better and slowly the pain came back as I got older it's 16 years later and I could tell that my posture is getting worse. Constantly hold my posture and try to derotate my scoliosis, similar to a lot of the exercises, non-invasive corrective modalities. They all involve working your curve, uh, working your body against the curve to help derotate and prevent further curving. I've seen other channels on YouTube about exercising with scoliosis, sleeping with scoliosis, and they've talked about straightening their posture as much as they can, just manually while you're working with your muscles. However, I find that's not going to be a permanent solution because that requires a constant conscious effort to always be thinking to derotate your spine and hold yourself up. It's exhausting mentally, physically. I don't see how it's a realistic solution for something that could end up crushing our organs and inhibiting our breathing and lots of other possible complications. But I know um, I can look in the mirror and see the way my posture has changed when I stand in a relaxed way. And that's what I find concerning. What I currently am doing, like I said, is just trying to stand in the straightest way possible with still having a severe rotation and curve. I know that my organs are at risk. The surgery is, it's not, um, at least for me, it's not the end all be all. It's not the only thing to do and then you're done and you can move on. It's a lifelong relationship, right? So, what do we do? What is there to do? That's what I would like to discover. I, I want to know, is there some way we can get support in holding our posture the way it needs to be without atrophying our muscles I know that's like asking almost the impossible, right? We already have muscles that are atrophied and nerves that don't work anymore. There needs to be something to prevent our bodies just physically going into back into crookedness or more crookedness, I should say. That's basically my message today. Those are my concerns. I'd like to know if you have these concerns if there's anything that you have found that works for you. These are serious concerns for future health and well-being, quality of life, and survival. Thanks so much. Namaste.